The uh, burst hole fire, as of 7.30 last night, was contained. Uh, we know that one private residence was uh, damaged, that's a home, was damaged last night. Uh, we know that other fires in the area were managed by the local fire departments such as Richmond, Montero, Leader and Alsace. Uh, we also know that in terms of the Burstall fire there was no uh, damages in the town of Burstall. As of this morning the uh, evacuation was lifted at 08.45, so that's 8.45 a.m. they lifted the evacuation and uh, families that relocated to Kindersley last night are in the process of making their way back. That's a local decision and they're pretty much mobile, don't need any support from the province, but they'll be making their, back, uh, their way back today, depending on what they think in terms of the power outages and the impact to the community. In terms of Richmond, uh, Richmond we, uh, we recognized that last night there was a lot of confusion, a lot of, a lot of information that came out that wasn't verified, wasn't vetted, and we had a difficult time keeping up with that because it was so fast moving. As of this morning, what we can tell you is that uh, folks did evacuate to Maple Creek and Medicine Hat, and that three farms were actually affected uh, in the Rich Mound area. We also know that some livestock was damaged or, uh, or killed, and that is being managed by the appropriate agencies within the government of Saskatchewan and the local community. In terms of Tompkins, uh, Tompkins fire was actioned by uh, Gull Lake Fire Department. Uh, they're mopping up hot spots, hot spots as, uh, as of right now. We know that there was one private residence, that's a home, that was lost, one barn, and also one shed that was lost.